hi guys and welcome back to a weekly vlog i have finally got my mojo back and i thought it would be a really nice really nice really good idea to um film one or two more weekly vlogs um just to kind of round off the year i was looking back through um my youtube last night the videos i've done and i haven't done a weekly vlog since goat got poorly basically and um i've got quite a few things on this week so i thought it would be a good week to weekly vlog i've been in a bit of a funk for the last two months while goat's been poorly so i thought if i'm vlogging it holds me a little bit more accountable so I, i'm just looking at him in his field he's eating his round veil it's really really foggy today it's pretty nasty weather um it's 10 something in the morning um Ella put goat out this morning and the temperature according to my car is 0.5 degrees so um that's fun not but i'm actually working today i'm working a late shift i start work at two but i just want to quickly um grab the camera out and start the weekly vlog off i'm feeling really positive and um, this is the best i felt like mindset wise um for a long time um i have made a cake this morning i made a smoothie for breakfast who is this girl um but i'm hoping i can just keep this positivity going because i haven't been myself um but yeah i've got a busy week planned i'm working today and then off tuesday wednesday uh working thursday late shift but then i'm going to take friday off i'm going to go christmas shopping with mum got a few christmas things planned um i think i'm going to ride brock getting my hair done um yeah there's plenty going on this week a little bit of horsey stuff a little bit of normal life and i also just want to say please ignore the state of my face um yeah i've been very very stressed and i am one of those people when we get stressed my face shows it so i always get spots like down in this area um and i was thinking this morning i was like oh i better put makeup on because i'm vlogging and then i was like no i'm not going to because it happens to the best of us so yeah this is me i want my hat out as well it's cold anyway i'm waffling um time to go and do my chores how exciting i'm not going to show you them because i literally just filmed a morning routine a couple of weeks ago so if you want to know what i'm doing watch my morning routine video um yeah i'm waffling anyway it's gonna be a good week it's very foggy but if you had a fresh round bale last night so he's very happy today i'll give it a week before it looks like a donut and he's made a hole in the middle this is what the yard looks like in winter <laughs> feet are very unhappy peanut we've had so much rain uh, if you can hear water i'm just doing their water it was frozen earlier oh p you are a proper bog pony today i've swapped to the iphone because i left my camera in the car because the screen's broken you ready for your advent calendar goats come across mum bought him an advent calendar and i've been a bad owner what's the date today it's the oh the seventh sorry i was looking at my watch i think he's only had one two three four five oh whoops he needs two more um right where's the sixth there have that one and then where's the seventh ah these are they make these so hard to get into especially when you're wearing gloves there we go i've popped open the doors so i can get it out and there's goatee ready for your advent calendar he knows what's inside. <laughs> Let me get it out then. Hang on. Put it down here. <laughs> You're a bit special, aren't you? There you go. Nice. Boy. Yum yums. Good morning. This has not gone to plan. Um, I is it's about mid morning now. I've been up, I've done all my jobs. Plan is to hack Mr. Brock today. Start attacking up, and all of a sudden there's loads of fog. Um, hang on, there's a car coming. I swear whenever I vlog out hacking, <laughs> there's always cars. Anyway, I literally 
put the tack on, was then going to put his bridle on and looked up and all of a sudden it's foggy. Um, we are maybe 200 metres from the river um, and less than a mile from the sea, I reckon. So basically the fog comes in, the sea mist comes in and yeah, I text Ella and she lives like five minutes up the road and it's beautifully sunny. So yeah, it's really annoying. I wouldn't usually ride in the fog, but because I've already tacked up, um, we're literally just going to go round a short loop, um, which involves maybe five minutes of road work, if that, and then we'll come round the field back. But it was annoying because I wanted to go for a really nice long hack this morning, but never mind, can't do anything about the weather. Um, and then this afternoon, I'm going to get my eyebrows done, all the excitement. And then I've got a sports massage um, because my hamstrings are really tight. Not that I've been riding or anything, but it's because I haven't been doing any exercise. Um, my hamstrings are really tight and my back hurts. So I'm going for a sports massage. So I'm in the best condition, ready for when Goatee comes back into work soon. Um, but yeah, put the phone away now because rock's spooky at the best of times, let alone in fog. <laughs> this is what it looks like. Usually there's the river over there, but no, this is for visibility. Less than ideal. Literally though, we're just going 100 metres maybe, just down this road, and then we'll be on field for the rest of it. So we'll be all right when we rock. I don't think the camera is actually picking up how foggy it is. That's the sun. <laughs> I have no idea where we are on the stall field, but it's all right. If we keep going around the edge, we'll end up home. So we can't get lost, can we, Brock? Although it is, it's definitely freezing fog. It's a bit nippy. I can feel my face freezing, um, like my cheeks. The temperature has just dropped. I mean, it was only one degrees anyway, but yeah, it's very, very cold. Um, not ideal hacking, but at least Brock's had a leg stretch today. And I've had my horsey fix, so. Um, it's quite good because the route that we've just done, not this double field bit, but the little walk on the road that we did will be one of goats, probably the first week of goats work, that will be the route that I hack him on. I've got it all planned. I'm not counting down or anything. <laughs> I don't know if you can see, but all of these, good boy Brock, all of these plants are frozen. Like that's the white is where they're frozen in the fog. That's how cold it is. Brock's on a mission to get back to the stables. It's a lot later now. Oh, my lights come on. You can see the fog, I think. Um, my f camera, yeah, there you go. That is how foggy it is, guys. Um, but yeah, just got Goatee in. He's had his dinner. Haven't you, Goatee? He's got a few, um, hang on. Um, I'm still wearing my nice jumper underneath my um, yard coat. No, nope, that's no better. How can I get it without the light? There we go. Um, he's got a little bit of a um, rash this evening, haven't you, Goatee? On his right hand side. Please don't put your dirty lips in my hair. Um, yeah, he's got, it's really odd as well. They're like perfect circles. <laughs> I'm not very good with my hand signals, am I? Perfect circles um, on his, yeah, right flank. Very, very odd. And they're like hard lumps. And he can't have rolled in anything because he's wearing a rug. So I'm not sure what happened there. But anyway, I've just popped him to bed and I'm going home now for some dinner. And then, yeah, I got my eyebrows done, had a sports massage. My back feels so much better. She said my hamstrings were not good. Um, and yeah, tomorrow I'm getting my hair done and Goatee's going to the vet. So it's all go. It's all go. Right, Goatee. Night, night. Can I say good night? <laughs> night, night. Okay, night, night. Be good boy at the vets tomorrow. Are you gonna be good boy? <laughs> Come on then, right, I'm going now. You're distracting me. That's why I spend ages up here in the cold, isn't it? Oh. Yuck. Yuck. Ah, here we are again. Hi guys. So I've actually been a bad vlogger. I'm actually talking to you while I'm stuck at the train tracks. I've been a bad vlogger. I've forgotten my vlogging camera. It is lunchtime on Wednesday now. I haven't spoken to you since last night. This morning's been manic. I've just been at the hairdressers. Um, and yeah, I'm now rushing to get Goatee to the vet. So I will film what I can, but um, there's not gonna be a lot of footage today because it's non-stop. I need to get Goatee to the vets for half two. It's about 45 minutes away, half 12 now. I've got to get him tagged up, so yeah. Um, and there's someone walking past the car thinking I'm a right weirdo, so let's end this here. 
look, Rockies is having a nap. Mm, in the mud. <laughs> is that your trailer, Goatee? Oh no, you know what that means? We're going to the vets. Oh no, mum, not again. Good boy. Twice, twice in one day. This time I've got um, goatee on the back though. So yes, off we go to the vets. We have made it and I am smashing it at the moment. I turned my trailer around as soon as I got here with Goatee on board. So now there is no stress and he can just have his treatment and then load him up and go. But he's having his hox medicated today as well. Um, and hopefully this will be the last time um, that we come up here. I hope. Um, yeah, I've been up here a lot and they've taken all my money. So, um, yeah, fingers crossed this will be the last time. But he's been a very good boy. He's so much happier traveling on a full tummy. Because obviously every other time we've come up here, he's been scoped. So he's had an empty tummy. So now he can have a hay net and he's a happy boy. But anyway, I've got my hat on ready because it's freezing. And yeah, just wait for them because of COVID. You have to wait in your car and then they come take him. And then that's it, basically. You just hand him over with your mask on. It's very weird but it is what it is it has been <laughs> well over an hour and a half oh is someone coming back to talk to me hang on hang on it's been a long time basically um the vet was running late um which is fine these things happen they're emergencies and call outs take longer so goat and i had to sit here in the car park for about an hour um and he's just gone in but then there was some confusion because he's having his hocks medicated today as well um his old vets hadn't sent across detailed enough information and um yeah it's just been a little bit stressful i had to ring them up but yeah hopefully anyway we try to go up on the concrete and obviously as expected he is um sam said two tenths lame one of his hind legs which is to be expected he always goes lame when he's out of work um, and that's why he has his hox medicated. So hopefully that's just caused by um, the arthritis in his joints because he hasn't been moving, obviously. He just literally goes from his stable to the field and back again. Um, but yeah, he's in there now. I ha just heard the clippers going, so he's having little ball patches on his legs ready for the big old needles to go in. Um, and then, yeah, I will take him home. He'll be all sleepy. Take him home and tuck him up in bed. But the only annoying thing is now it's going to be rush hour traffic driving home. But nothing that can be done about it and then tonight actually i think we're putting the christmas tree up at home so um i might try and film um some of that hopefully go to you need to wake up because we're going home come on wakey wakey going home now we have one very very sleepy goat you've got to wake he's actually snoring <laughs> You've got to wake up because we've got to go home. Can we go home? I love it. It sounds so mean, but when they're sedated, they're just so cuddly. Come on, darling. Got to wake up now. <laughs> Coat's got his little bandages on from where he's had his hocks injected. Right, come on then, mister. Can you put your boots on? We're going to go home now. And we are home. Goaty's just eating his dinner. Um, I'll just show you. He usually wears oh, stable wraps at night, but I haven't been able to put his wraps on tonight because um, this area here is obviously where he's been injected and his wraps come up to about here. So I don't think it would be wise to kind of cover the area. It needs to scab over. Um, so yeah, he had an injection in there on both legs. And then he had just one on the inside, I'll show you from here, on the inside of the joint as well, and the same on the same on this one. But he's fine, he's eating his dinner. Survived a trip, didn't you, Goatee? Noisiest eater in the world. So yeah, well, I've got a bit of bushy hair now. He is home, the trailer is parked, and he I okay, very closely got stuck in the mud turning round. Um, but it's all done now and I'm going to go home and do the Christmas tree but Goat's got to stay in for um, 48 hours now so the vet doesn't want him to go out again until Saturday morning so he's not going to be impressed being stuck in here but um, it's all for the best and then yeah 
another week and a half basically and then we can start bringing it back into work if all goes to plan. We've got to be a good boy. We've got to be. Okay, right, I'm going home. <laughs> Good morning. Look how clean my car. Can you see? Uh, there we go. Look how shiny my car is. Let me just show you. I have my car cleaned um, this morning. Very lazy of me. Um, oh, it hasn't been this clean since I bought it. But I've had to be very careful. I've parked it all the way over there because look at this. Um, yeah. Try and not to put loads of mud in it now and change my shoes and be good it was full of bedding like bits of bedding and everything it was grim um but anyway it is thursday um it's about mid-morning uh ella fed go to this morning and i've now come up he's got to stay in for two days obviously so i'm now here to muck him out check he's okay top up his hay oh darling you're sulking are you eating are you eating good you okay you're not even gonna come say hello i think he's okay um, yeah, I'm just going to muck him out and take him just, um, Sam said just to walk him to a little walk, check he's not lame or anything and then I'm going to work this afternoon. So nothing exciting today. Goatee is all done now. You're all done, aren't you? Quite happy in here with your hay, good boy. <laughs> His legs look, you can't see it's dark. His legs look really good anyway. Um, no swelling, no heat, which is really good. Just a couple of days in here, goatee, and then you'll be back at it. Good morning. <laughs> oh, I bloody love that Christmas song. I'm not even, um, I haven't been in a Christmassy mood, but the last couple of days I'm definitely feeling the Christmas vibes. It's Friday, by the way. Um, it's chucking it down with rain. Um, there's no way my car's clean anymore. Um, but it was clean for 24 hours and the inside is clean. So, um, yeah, it's Friday and mum and I are going to go to Norwich today to do some Christmas shopping. I'm going to get very wet if this carries on. Goatee is on his last day of box rest. Ella fed him first thing because I finished work at midnight last night. So, um, yeah, he's got hay and he's been fed, but I'm now just going to skip him out. Yeah, it's not a bad day to be in, to be honest with you. It's just, it's disgusting weather. We've had so much rain. Um, yeah, everywhere's underwater and boggy and horrible. Hurry up, Summer. Here he is. How you doing, handsome? Mum, I want to come out. Look at these curtains as well. Look at these curtains. Hey. You go out tomorrow. It's miserable out here today. Look. Disgusting, nobody's happy. Better off in there. How messy is your stable? Oh dear, goatee. Right, let's get to work because I've got to go Christmas shopping. You excited for Christmas? What's Father Christmas going to bring you? Have you been a good boy this year? Ah, eh, fairly. <laughs> All done. Goatee's got his multiple hay nets. I don't know if you can see. Nice clean bed. Goat's not always all about you, you know. Which is mum. Is that orange? Is that orange? I've just put him out. And he can't even... He has to have a roll. Usually he'd eat his breakfast, but he's gone straight down for a roll. Ah, uh, uh, good boy. And now we have breakfast. <laughs> Goat, digging is not required. Good afternoon even. It is Saturday and this is what's happening right now. <laughs> Basically, um, one of the, our round bales has given both goat and brock hives. I spoke about it on the vlog earlier in the week. So we're gonna swap it and we said to the hay man, do you want us to bring it back? And he was like, yeah, well, I don't think he realized that Ella had actually opened it. So now, <laughs> now we have a lorry full of hay. Is this 
big as you almost. Good deal, isn't it? We are back, we've got the hay and I've just put out a grid for, where is she? Mr. Rockies and Ella. Have a little jumping session at home this afternoon. So just sit your bum in the saddle, shoulders back, half out. You can get 20 strides in there. Go, that's it. Onto this time. So try it now, half out with your outside rein, and get into this into you. You're gonna naturally get yeah, wet. Like yeah. So now just keep that, that's it, go, and then go. There you go. Try and get your bouncy canter again. That's it, like that is the one. And he waits for you, just like sit on your bum and tell him what you want. One, two, go, that's it. Right, now kick on. That's it. One, two, go. I can't remember. No, I have started the vlog. Oh, what's going on with this? I've got that line on my head. I've been riding! Not goatee. Um, I will have inserted the footage. Um, Ella let me have a little play on Rockies again. He's just so cool. He's so cool. He is... He looks easy to ride. Like, when I've watched Ella ride him before, I've always thought... Not thought he was easy, but thought, oh, he's fairly straightforward. But then when you get on him, completely different kettle of fish. But so fun and so rewarding. Um, so, yeah, that was fun. It is now raining again. Absolutely chucking it down. I am just... Um, finishing goatee stable off I did the full muck out today as you can see some new bedding to put in um, so I'm just going to finish that off and then I'm going to go home because going to Essex tonight to meet um, Hannah for dinner outside outside in the mucky so we're allowed um, but yeah I'm going to do that tonight and then I think that'll be it for this week's vlog to be honest with you oh my arm's aching hang on and there we go yeah tomorrow I've vlogged for six days. I think we've got enough. My camera screen is still wonky. Um, yeah, I guess I'm going to round up the vlog here. I might insert some clips. Um, oops, someone's walking down the track. The horses have noticed. Um, I might insert some clips from dinner tonight, maybe. But if not, then um, thank you for watching. I can't talk this afternoon. And I've kind of planned my schedule for... Um, the rest of the year oh my god that's so scary so I think I'm going to try and do one more weekly vlog which will be like a Christmas weekly vlog so um, next week I'm working a really long week and then the week after it's like Christmas week but at the end of the week and that ties in with when I should be bringing goat back into work so I think there will be oh my screw's gone wonky here we go I think there will be uh, what I'll try to do is a um, one more weekly vlog like a Christmas goat comes back into work hopefully please and then um that will be the last weekly vlog of 2020 how scary is that and then my last video my last actual video of 2020 which i'll put up around new year just before probably will be like my 2020 review which i did last year i did a 2019 one it's like my favorite video to make with like all the not all the not even all the best bits just all the snippets of everything basically from the whole year um, but yeah, I think I'm now four subscribers from 500, so if you haven't already, please subscribe. Um, I just need four more of you to hit my goal. Um, it really would mean the world. Anyway, I'm off link. I'm going to finish Goat Stable now. Go get ready. I might speak to you later. Uh, I might not. If not, see you all in the next video. We are out for dinner. Look who's here. <laughs> We're sat outside, hence the scarf. You can put your blanket I'm over. I'm over. I'm full. And you've got a blanket that you have to I've got, yeah, I've got a blanket. And we've ordered all the food. Basically, if you ever go out with a dinner with Hannah, she orders like a hundred starters. I've got two starters. 
and maize. That's quite civilised. Yeah, when, when we went to the quarries, you got like four or five starters. It was tapas, okay? You're allowed to order like five starters. If you're ever going to take Hannah on a date, it's going to be expensive. Yeah. And we've got our alcoholic drinks. And the substantial meal is coming. <laughs> Pretend you're sharing. <laughs> We're not sharing. This yeah. is you. Look at the size of them. That's what I mean. They're huge. They're like a brick. <laughs> Here we go. Course one. This smells. I mean, it doesn't look very attractive. Beef bourguignon. What have you got, Hannah? <laughs> Salmon on croutons. Salmon on croutons. Look at that. And yes, you did eat all I your did starters. Get a, a bit last weekend, though. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> and more drinks, obviously. We are literally mid dinner and Hannah has just made a renovation which I didn't know. Tell the tell the floor. What did you call it? A renovation. A renovation. <laughs> a revelation. <laughs> right, so I very quietly, she always moans at me. I don't watch YouTube and all this stuff. I don't, I don't. Right? I joined YouTube and I subscribed to her and she hasn't even realised. Oops. Then did you actually join YouTube because you're gonna start yeah. YouTube? Well, Coming soon! Keep your eyes out for that! I don't get too excited, I've got to suss it out first. <laughs> but you were a subscriber? I'm a subscriber! I subscribed! I'm a bad friend, I didn't even notice. <laughs> I've been waiting weeks for her to say, Oh my god, you subscribed! No, I didn't even realise. Back to dinner Back to now. Ah, <laughs> uh, da 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 da, the best course. Hannah's not having dessert. Oh my god! Look Hannah's at you! <laughs> you look so bougie as well, it's like velvet. <laughs> right, I'm gonna eat this now. <laughs> We've just had a very funny moment. I posted our selfie and someone replied saying that I look stunning. What about me? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, babe. I know I'd have a great, but you know, it would be nice. <laughs> Everyone comment below. That would be nice. <laughs> it is 20 past 11. I just realised that you can only really see half my face, but I just got home. Um, I basically finished the vlog earlier, so I just wanted to say goodbye, basically. Good night, guys, and I will see you in my next video. <laughs>